Hunter fly earlier. The flip over on his back. And then you've got Dean Ferris, who will be way, way up there in lane number eight. They're finalist in the Hunter back. There have been a lot of fans complaining that Ferris hasn't gotten a chance to lead off a relay yet and get one of those splits. He will lead off a relay here. Let's move back into a play. Also a butterfly finalist, Umit Gurish, who finished eighth in the 100 fly. He'll swim the fly leg for the Crimson. Watch Minky. He finished ninth on the console for Alabama. Take your mark. Their front half should be stacked. Yeah. Alabama then has Derek Moss to swim the breaststroke. Alabama could be in the lead after the first two legs. They've got that kind of firepower. Lasco was third for Cal in the 100 back. Whitley was fourth, so you... You would expect the lead to come from them. That's a great start, though, for Luca Orlando in Georgia. In two out in 2076. 20.7 .7 on the feet. That's actually faster than Ryan Murphy's record of 20.43.4. He is the Swiss Army knife of this meet. Luca Orlando has Georgia flying here early. Let's see how he holds it together. The second and up in lane eight, Harvard is in third. 43 3. I'll say it again. <laughs> if you're not paying attention, 43 3 for Luca Orlando. My goodness. And he's a sophomore. And he can do it in basically every stroke. Holy smokes. That's done enough to keep George out front. Remember, they've got NCAA champ Matthew Saints coming on the third leg. But here comes Whitley and now Kevin. Oh, was that huge or what? That was 50.5 and change for Reese Whitley. And now it's Trenton Julian, a finalist in the 100 fly out there for Cal. Alabama has taken over second. Harvard with Umit Gurish, another fly finalist in contention up in eight. Trenton Julian actually a couple top eight finishes here. He swam the medley relay, the 200 medley relay, where he was 20.1. He's going to be good. Oh, this is a good split here for Julian. Out in 20.3 at the 50. And remember, Cal's not just racing these other no. seven teams. They are trying to set the mark that stands up for the fourth and final heat. And they bring out Bjorn Seeliger, the runner-up in the 53. 44-3 for Trenton Julian, who's been all over the place for Cal. This is a runaway for the Bears, just what they needed in this third heat of four. And that is a race between Alabama and Harvard for second. 18-9 on the feet. 18-9 on the feet for Seeliger. And here comes Seeliger. How low can he go? You beat perhaps the greatest backstroker ever in Ryan Murphy. And then it was a Cal runaway there at the end, Rowdy. And then Murph's team Cal! Yeah. <laughs> Had the last payback, word! Right? Yeah. <laughs> well, we told you, we thought that was about as good a foursome as he could put together, and four great legs there for the Bears have set that lead time of 3.0036. Seeliger bringing it home at the end. So that is the timeout there for the eight coming in the fourth and final heat. Seeliger still hanging around in the pool. <laughs> it's like he's trying to freeze the fourth heat here. So Cal.